All right, just doing a little video on uh, how to get more coal. It's, uh, I don't know about anyone else, but I was like hardcore struggling with getting coal at the beginning of this game. But it turns out you, there's just kind of like an easy exploit. Well, not really an exploit, it's just mainly part of the game. But you can have the skill trees in mining. If you level this up, you have a percent chance of getting coal. It's just good for passively getting it, but You'll probably find that that won't be enough coal just from mining. You'll be getting way more ore than you'll be getting coal. So in the furnace, you're able to craft wood into coal. So I wasn't doing that because I thought 15 wood, that's way too much. I don't want to cut down all the trees in my area. That would take too long and that it just wouldn't really be worth it. Well, turns out it's probably the best way of getting coal in the game by like a long shot. Like, so you can just go to your yard, wherever it is, just literally break every single tree and then turn it all into coal. You you basically need to do that like one time and then you'll pretty much have enough coal for like the rest of the game. At least that's what I found. Like if you do this and then go all the way up and break all of the extra stuff, like right side of the map here, you can break a lot of trees here, especially to the left of your farm. You can get a bunch of trees in this area. But yeah, just go around your farm, break all the trees, and if you're worried about them not growing back, they will just automatically grow back. It doesn't even take long. Like if you wait like a week in the game, they'll like all already be back. So it's just not something you have to worry about at all. And then of course, to make this a little bit better, if it's taking you too long or you only have a copper axe, you can level up a lot of these, which will make your tree breaking a lot faster. And then I think some of them increases like the amount of logs dropped, which also helps. And then what I'd recommend doing is just going to the furnace, plopping them all in, and then going to sleep, and then most of them will cook overnight, and then your issue for coal will just kind of like stop. Because it, it was a big problem for me. I like had none like at all times, and then I did this one time and I got like 200 coal. And I just haven't even gone through that yet, and I what I'm using to craft now just doesn't even need coal, so that'll hopefully be helpful.